something? This is like the toughest oyster in history. Like, <laughs> what, what happened? Like, what, what happened? Like, what was the deal? I don't know. I mean, like, <laughs> yeah, the oyster that took down Metallica. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, it was at the very last show of our last leg, yeah. and we had. There's a few places we're getting to do doubles, which is awesome. Yeah. To, uh, and this last one was in Sweden, uh, in Stockholm. We had done the first show, and there's not many times where all the support acts. We've got Machine Head, we got Sword out with us, sort of but we're actually from here. yes, yeah. they are. You know, where there's not many places where we're actually in the same town and the same day off. You know, together. So there was a night where we went out and kind of just had a celebration between shows. It's a bunch of food laid out that maybe was laid out a little too long. <laughs> I don't know. Um, but uh, the next day, it just started to feel really bad. And I, I, it, I, I, man, I tried so hard to not cancel the show. It's so lame. <laughs> I, you know, it's tough to call in sick in our gig. And I just don't want to disappoint people. And we're already there. The gear's there. It's like... And I was so sick, I swear, I could not stand up without falling over. It was so bad. I was so dehydrated. They had an IV. The doctor came in. He took my blood pressure. It was 80 over 60. I mean, I was... I mean, he had an IV of saline in his car. And he brought it in. He taped it up to the lamp next to the bed and plugged me in. And, of course, you know, the, the stuff's supposed to be at room temperature. It was freezing. And I went into this, you know, my... I was chattering and oh it was it was an event